Hi, and welcome to your planetary archetype in Mercury. My name is Nicole Harlow, and I'm here as your guide through your planetary archetype. I just want to point out here in the beginning that just because you got Mercury here as your primary archetype today doesn't mean that it will always be your primary archetype. It doesn't mean that you'll stay Mercury. Some people will stay the same sign throughout their whole life. Other people will change every year or two. Some people change a couple times in a week. It depends on how changeable your personality is. Some people are really set in stone. Other people are a bit more flexible. Um, but someone who has a primary archetype in Mercury, this is a fast moving planet. This is the planet that um, typifies expressive communication. So this is similar to, if you're familiar with the zodiac signs, uh, Mercury planetary archetype is similar kind of like if we combined a Gemini with a Virgo. So the logical, pragmatic thinking that comes from a Virgo combined with the expressive, quick, clever, witty, fast moving energy of a Gemini air sign. So when I think of Mercury, some things that come to mind for me are communication, intelligence, um, just a kind of bright cleverness as well, expressiveness, and most often Mercury's expression is verbal, uh, but this can also come out artistically in music and dance, um, just because it, um, the Mercury type is just expression in general. But I just find that typically the expression is more verbal, and kind of intellectual, and like from the brain, like sort of all up here in the head. Um, Mercury types are pretty confident and familiar with words, you know, um, familiar with the going from the mind, taking kind of parsing information and parsing thoughts out into words, you know, using language to connect and to communicate and to develop um, not only relationships and friendships, but also businesses as well and uh, careers. So Mercury types um, could be really well suited for being a professor or a teacher or a writer, a counselor, something that has words and expression at its core. Mercury types are also really curious, um, curious to learn, curious to connect, and curious to communicate. Um, something that I want to do and that I like to do in these little short archetype videos is just kind of leave you with um, just an area to look out for as a Mercury planetary archetype. And the thing that kind of comes up for me and that I want to share is that as a Mercury type, you can be very, very used to living with energy up here in your head, say from like the throat chakra up here into your brain. Um, you're a very logical thinker. You're someone who is comfortable in their own mind and comfortable with their intellect um, and somebody who really speaks from the head, from the thoughts. And the one thing that I would say is to just remember to speak from your heart as well, to make that connection between brain and body to um, when you're in Mercury and you're used to communicating and you're used to being expressive, sometimes it's easy, you may find it easy to just almost have verbal diarrhea or vomit or whatever to just like say, string a bunch of words together without actually checking into the heart, without checking into the gut, without checking in down through the body to see how this actually lands with you, how you actually feel. Um, sometimes as a Mercury, you can be really obsessed with saying the right thing, um, really censoring your words until you've constructed the right thing to say. And I would just say, to make sure that you're checking in with your body and to make sure that you're checking in with your heart as well. Um, not just focusing on saying the right words, but making sure that it's in alignment with the rest of you as well. Anyway, thank you so much for being here with me. Uh, I hope that you kind of stick around and learn with me more, connect with me more. Um, 
I teach and work with tarot, astrology, zodiac, uh, moon energy, and um, I host the Your Year of Radical Transformation program. So perhaps I'll see you in the program this year. Um, I'm also sending you a Radical Transformation Toolkit, which should be zipping its way to your inbox right now. If you don't see it, check your junk mail folder because it might be in there. And if you want to learn more about the program, um, just look below this video all the way down to the bottom and uh, you can click on that link and learn some more. Anyway, once again, I'm Nicole Harlow. It's really nice to meet you. Um, see you later, Mercury. Bye.